the entire New Testament based on those on those writings earlier than the manuscript. Okay. Bring me bring me evidence. I'm here, bro. Yeah, yeah. So, I'm, I'm okay. talking about specifically the gospel. Okay. So, so, uh, so the two things that you can bring me next week. One is historic evidence that Heli was the stepfather of Joseph. Historic evidence. Eusebius was a liar. He was. It's, don't look he's, it up. He's accused. He's, he's, okay, okay. In, in hadith, if you're accused of being a liar in hadith, we cannot accept hadith. Okay, that's you though. I know. That's not the historic. What, 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 okay, what I'm trying to explain to you is, what I'm trying to explain to you is, he is a historian. He wasn't physically there. Right? Okay. Okay. And he is somebody who even Christians have called him to be a liar. Uh, I gave you the references. I mean, bring you the references. We'll, we'll, we'll look at the next I'll bring them. No problem. We'll, we'll, They're in the video too. We put them on the screen so you can go look it up. Okay. Look, look it up. Right. So he has been accused of being a liar. So you have a historian who wasn't physically there, who has no actual physical evidence. It's his writing, his opinion, and he's been accused of being a liar. Right. Yeah, but he doesn't present like okay in this manuscript it says it's just his writing. He's not accused of being a liar. I don't know. Okay, so, so this is the problem which the difference between us, okay? If somebody's a liar, I'm not gonna base my salvation on their words. So are they a proven liar or accused? Again, in, in hadith. If they're accused, it's over. Let me explain. Let me explain. In hadith, even Tuhmatul Kadab, the accusation of Kadab makes it that you're rejected. So that's, this is how pure our religion is. That's 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 very that's beautiful, very right? Strict, Thank you. But no, no, like, like, you like no, it? No, Come no, on, no, man. No, you know it's strict. But that's, but that's your standard. You I can't know. say that. Oh, yeah, someone else's again, standard is, is invalid. But, but you're talking to me. Yeah. I'm gonna tell you from if you bring me historic evidence. A writing of a later historian who's been accused of a liar is not evidence to me, right? Because this is not saying that I was there and Heli did this or, or in this, in this, in this Hebrew research. But, but, but well, again, again, his research is not first-hand reports, right? Okay. So can you find me? Can you, he was not there. So again, what we can agree to. Sure, there are historians that said Jesus didn't exist, right? I mean, there's a, there's, there's, again, again, look, 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 I don't think so. I mean, there, there are atheists, there, there's an there's a atheist that came here to debate with us, and he's a professor, and he made this whole claim, and again, I'm not saying he's right, I do, I do believe Jesus existed, but what I'm saying is, a historian making a claim is not evidence in itself, okay? So, if you can bring me actual first-hand historic evidence, that would be great. But to bring me the writings of a his later historian that doesn't give any first-hand reports, who's himself accused of being a liar, you know that doesn't make the cut. So, so, you know it, right? So, uh, it, it, doesn't, it doesn't make the cut. Thank you. Uh, it, it, doesn't, it doesn't make the cut. Thank you. Uh, it, it, doesn't, it doesn't make the cut. Thank you. When you're, no, according to you, uh, according to an accusation. It doesn't sure. mean that his accusation is true. It doesn't sure. mean anything like that. Look. But an accusation in your right. standard, even if he's not oh, yeah. proven a liar. Hadith is such a beautiful it. science. We make sure yeah. that we check the narrators. So, so let me... Okay. Let me Let me, so, no, let me, going, going back to talking about 